Okay, we got some more fish today. We got a total of 28 more fish. And these little guys, I have some buddies now. <laughs> what a wimp. Here we are, 10 hours later. Son, you're a wimp. Son, you're a strength. You're a so much. Oh, wow, I didn't see this side, then Sean grab the other one. The new ones probably won't eat though, right? Oh, they might. They see the other ones being calm, so I think they'll... Call him. That's pretty cool. They're swimming in a school now. They're saying hi to each other. Huh? The one you saved came in, going to school now. Yeah. Right. Here comes these guys. Cool colors in there. Yeah. I really like that uh, that black and orange, the smaller one. There's a control. How many fish are in there now? Uh, it should be 30. No, it should be 40. 12 and 28, yeah, 40. Yeah.
aquí. This is my attempt at a bonsai. Don't know how I did, but before that it kind of looked like a piece of broccoli, if you will. But my wife likes it, so I'm not going to complain too much. But when it comes to this here, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I guess the object is trying to have it look like a uh, mature tree. I thinking of possibly adding wire to kind of, I don't know, move these, some of these little branches around. Anyhow, that's that. Hey, Mr. Ducky or Mrs. Ducky came back up. After the herring attack, we lost three of the uh, koi. I was forced to enclose the entire pond area with this wire. I'm not sure if you could tell, but it's... Here we go. Here. It's a bird netting. Got it at Home Depot. And it's roughly about 45 by... I want to say 28 feet. That encompasses the entire top side. So it starts from this far left here, all the way to the far wall back there. And right by the pine tree there. And it comes all the way to the edge of the house there. Well, this part of the house right there. All the way up this way. And right above me right here and I have it supported with a uh, 400 pound fishing line and the little birds are able to fly in fly out without any problem I kind of left them some escape areas along the fence here so now when we see the blue air heron fly overhead he just looks down and keeps on flying <laughs> And here's the male duck. The ducks and the turtles and the koi all seem to get along just well. Female duck over here. 